It is important because of three key reasons in my view. First, um, much of the narrative about Africa in the academia or the media world is still dominated by the West. And so it is no surprise that the popular imagination about what is happening in the continent, even here in Singapore, is very much influenced by how Africa is seen in London or DC. And what that really means is that if you're a fund manager or a, or a, or a venture capitalist sitting somewhere in Shenton Way, which is like the midtown Manhattan of Singapore, the Kingdom of Morocco would be seen as a riskier place to invest than, say, Malaysia. What I'm trying to say is that if Africa needs to get the kind of attention it deserves from Asia, that narrative needs to uh, be adjusted. Second, Africa and Asia are in some ways kindred spirits. The vast majority of our people in both the countries, um, in both the continents, share similar development and economic challenges. They share the same colonial experience, similar aspirations, even the outlook on community values, shared prosperity, and a deeply embedded, almost spiritual connection with the natural environment is the same. There is much to learn from each other about each other. And third, and this is perhaps much more specific to Singapore, Singapore is at the end of the day an international financial center and a global trading hub. Global trading hub. Its prosperity depends on facilitating the movement of goods, capital and ideas between the biggest and most dynamic economic centers of the world. How can it afford to ignore Africa? I am Lon Signé and this has been Foresight Africa. To learn more about this show and our report, visit brookings.edu slash Foresight Africa podcast. The Foresight Africa podcast is brought to you by the Brookings Podcast Network. Send your feedback and questions to podcast at brookings.edu My special thanks to the projection team including Kuelaleni Owanga supervising producer Fred Doos producer Nicole Tungire and Alexandria Cordero associate producers and Colin Crookshank audio engineer this show's art was designed by Shervanti Mendez. Additional support for this podcast comes from my colleagues in Brookings Global and the Office of Communications at Brookings.